Welcome to Money Doctor Show. I'm Sir Sudhir. Should you really invest in gold? Is gold an investment plan? Is this worth investing in gold? Will gold give us good returns? This is a question which most of the you know people will have. Many people consider gold as an investment. But today in this episode, I'm going to help you make a better decision. I'm going to give you some insights about how it really works. So let us look at the previous data. Let's understand how does it really work. So if you look at the data. Sometime in 1991, the gold was trading at about 3,400 rupee per for 10 grams. In 1991, in the by 2001, it was almost same, but it was about 4,000, 4,300. Which means there was not much growth between 91 to 2001. But again, if you look at the gold rate growth between 2001 to 2011, 4,000 rupee gold. Became literally twenty six thousand in two thousand eleven. It grew by almost six times. So that was an amazing growth. And then, if you look at it, two thousand eleven till now, the gold is trending at almost same twenty six to now twenty eight, twenty nine, thirty. So which means the gold has this cyclical thing. I mean, for ten years it may grow, the next ten years it may not grow. All this is happening. But even then. If you look at the history of gold, gold is a great investment. Nothing to worry; it is one of the safest. Gold has that advantage. But and again, it doesn't really require a lot of expertise. Anybody can do that. Now that Indian government has put a lot of restrictions in terms of how much gold you can really hold, you can really invest in gold, you know, funds also. There are a lot of exchange traded funds where go, you, know, you you can invest in gold funds. But then the point here is. Is this really wise to invest in gold jewelry? Many people have this habit that gold is an investment, so I'm buying gold jewelry. That's a bad idea. The reason you should not buy gold jewelry for investment is because number one, there will be making charges. The making charges varies from anywhere between 15 to 20 percent, which is like purely waste, lot of waste of money. Why do you want to do that? Tomorrow, after six months, one year, if you want to sell it off, this is gone. Not just that. Even when you are trying to sell the gold, these guys will actually deduct this wastage charges, that, this, and all that. And even when you are selling it, they may actually deduct certain other uh, things like you know the wastage or price deduction. They may not actually offer the same rate for which they sell. So keeping all these things in mind, it is wise to invest in gold if you are looking for long-term safe investment options. But Do not invest more than 10% of your total investable amount in gold. Maximum is 10%. Number two, if you are investing this 10%, make it a point that you 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 buy gold bars or gold coins, not jewelry. Gold jewelry is not an investment. Don't consider that. So if you need any assistance in choosing the right investment option, or if you have questions about gold investment, or if you're looking for tax planning guidance, please leave a missed call on IndianMoney.com financial education helpline number zero double two six one eight one six triple one. We will call you back, help you make wise financial decisions. Also, you can check your credit score for free on Indian Money website and Indian Money mobile app. We will help you improve your credit score as well. Thanks for watching. I'll be back with another topic tomorrow. Be wise, get rich.